sending straddle pike. We want to find our sense first of all, and we're going to do that with three steps. So heels first, toes, heels, and then turning our toes out. Once we are in this position, you're going to relax down, reach for the floor. Ideally, you want to be in contact with the floor either with your hands, if you're flexible enough, with your um, elbows, or even with your head. If that's comfortable, you can also try to reach back behind your feet. Now, it's, if your mobility is not quite there yet, you don't want to just hang off, but you want to use props. So you can use yoga blocks, books, a bench, have something as a target. You're going to run down, place your hand on the object of the correct eye and hold that position. As the stretch is going to feel easier and easier, you can then start lowering your prop as your body lets go of the tension. Now, a couple of things to look out for. One, when we are in this position, we don't want our hips to shoot back, but we want to stay on top of our midline and our feet. We also, for this one, don't want to keep the back straight, but the goal is to round down even to our back as much as we can. And of course, we want knees straight, we don't want to bend at the knees. 